It is an event making a huge difference for children right here in our community. The 2010 Daniel Guiding Hearts Gala is coming up next weekend. Today we have Jim Clark, the CEO and president of Daniel here with, uh, he's got masks this time. You don't usually have props, but you have some beautiful uh, props here this morning. Tell us what this is all about, Jim. Yes, the Art League of Jacksonville really helped our kids. And they put on, uh, they have made these masks, many of these masks have put into uh, these shadow boxes. And some of them are going to be auctioned off during the the gala itself. And the gala is really a, we're going to turn the MODIS building into a Venetian masquerade party. There are going to be all kind of different activities there. Uh, there will be these stilt walkers. They're called the Cherokee uh, stilt walkers, and they're 12 feet tall. We've got uh, the Nova Era, uh, which is a musical group that will be in town. But these masks in particular are going to be auctioned off, and they're going to be a great fundraiser for us. And we're really looking forward to it. So all the money goes to, to Daniel, right? All the money goes to help the kids. And this is one of the ways that the kids got involved with it. Uh, all of this helps our, our income for the, to help our kids. We have over 1,000 abused children who have been either removed from their home or suffering some kind of issues, everything from adoption to uh, unruly uh, youngsters. And what we try to do, we need uh, supplemental funds to make programs successful. And sponsors really help this, enterprise integration, integration in particular, but uh, ticket sales and things like that really help the, the kids of Northeast Florida. And these masks, I mean, they look great. They look really, really nice. And you said kids eight, for eight years old, as young as eight to what, about 14? Eight to 14, together? really, the Art League really did a great job. We had a gentleman, one of our trustees by the name of Lafayette Cope, and he does a great job with Citigroup, but he came out and helped us, along with Merrill Lynch and, and Julie Covington. Uh, all these trustees have really been involved to help us make this a really interesting event. We have Capital Grill that's going to be there and, and be part of the food. Uh, the the uh, Matthews uh, tidbits, uh, it's really going to be quite a, a, a day. Uh, there will be uh, valet parking. And so all you have to do is drive up, and they'll take care of your car. You're going to come up. You're going to see this Phoenician new uh, party and uh, be a part of that. And, again, proceeds. If you go to our website, you can either buy some additional masks because it's a formal wide tire, and there's all kind of different masks that people can buy. Along with that, too, there's, there's donations that people can make and other auction items. Now, you love, you talk about how important it is, you know, art in these kids' lives. Can you talk about that a little bit and how, how excited they were to do something like this? This is the first time you guys have done this, right? This actually is. Uh, they've stepped it up a notch in terms of our gala. And the Art League of Jacksonville was just really fantastic because they worked with our kids. And having children be able to experience express themselves artistically uh, uh, and then see the outcome, you can imagine the beam on their faces and just like these pictures kind of show, yeah. they were just having a great time and uh, we've got about 50 of these that are made and again, they'll all be auctioned off, all the proceeds go to help the uh, over 1,000 children that we have at, a, uh, at uh, Daniel and we certainly appreciate the, the community support and of course uh, your 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 WX, JXT's uh, support as well. Sure, absolutely. Well, here's the important information. This is how you can help. The information for the Moonlight Masquerade, it's going to be next Saturday, October 23rd, as you heard Jim say, at the Downtown Modus Building. Tickets are $150. For more information, you can go to guidingheartsgala.org. We've also posted the link on our website, newsforjax.com. Thanks, Jim. Thank you.